Hey guys, Gladys here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm so excited to do my boys' room makeover. They have been asking me for this makeover for months now. This is how their room looks like. There was nothing wrong with it. It was perfectly fine. But in my opinion, it was a bit small. There was not a lot of place for them to play. There was not a lot of place for toys to be gathered. And uh, I thought if I could give them a little makeover and started brainstorming exactly what to do. And this is how everything turned out i was able to sell the bed uh, to someone someone came to purchase the bed so i wanted to show you guys how i was opening it and gathering everything to um, bring it for the uh, person who's going to come and purchase it and then after that we are going to go to akia and see what they have there and see what i'm going to come up with for the kids let's go we're here at akia and I uh, found the bed that I wanted for the boys and this is the one this is it right here simple there's this one I don't know what all these yellow things on there is for I don't like that there's this one it's too woody that one is way too tall for that room so let's see what we get okay we have everything that goes together. These in the plastic bag are the exact same thing here. So there's bottom, there's top part. Also, right over here, all of these go together. These are from one box, so if you're confused, these are from one box, these are from one box. Now let's show you the other big ones. Okay, so I have the first part laid down. You want to go ahead and insert all of these in here. I'll go ahead and insert it and then show it to you what it looks like. Okay, this room is beyond a mess. It's so, so messy, but the bed has been made. I got some help by my brother-in-law. There was no way I could have done this myself. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of what I don't need here and some things are coming from Amazon tomorrow. So let's get the kids room all taken care of. Okay, so this is the cabinet that was in their closet and uh, I seen that I had a lot of things around that I could use instead of buying brand new things. So I decided to bring the cabinet and put it right here. It made more sense. It was very crowded in the closet. It was hard for them to get on top of the cabinet to the top shelf. So I decided to bring it over here. Now I wanted to spruce up the cabinet instead of having that all uh, IKEA, uh, what is it called? plain cabinet i decided to remove these black knobs and go ahead and add a, the gold pretty knobs listen those knobs are pretty i'm gonna purchase them for my cabinet in my kitchen because i'm like what for this amount of price and the quality of this cabinet it's been weeks now since the kids have been using this cabinet it's beautiful there they are look the simplicity and the gold on there it's so pretty and it was very easy very self-explanatory how to go ahead and add it on there i removed the old one use the new screws to add the new cabinet knobs on there and they are easy to go keep watching guys you do not want to miss the kids surprise face and reaction keep watching
guys, I'm going to go ahead and show you now how the kids room turned out. Please stay tuned for their reaction. I just love how this place feels so much bigger. It has a lot of space. The kids can run and play. And listen, my kids have been sleeping in the bed since I gave them this makeover. Usually, they will bother me at night and I'm wondering why they're doing that. They didn't have a bed where they felt passionate to sleep in. They ended up sleeping in the bed the whole weekend, the whole week, and I was so impressed. Now, let's tour this bedroom. As you can see here, I just kept their initial for Beto, Nazareth, a little clock on there, and a wall art behind the door. I still have their jacket for the winter there, and then I kept some books my kids love to read books. I love to give my kids books. Every time I go and purchase something for them, I come back home with books. And also when the books, they outgrow them because it's no longer their style, I give it to Goodwill. Now, I went in and organized each of their dressers because I got rid of lots of the clothes, didn't fit them anymore, give it to Goodwill or pass it on from the oldest to the youngest boy. So as you can see, all their run-around clothes for home, for whatever. And I'm going to also show you guys um, their clothes in their closet for what is it called, church and um, special occasions. So this is the cabinet that we did together. I love the simplicity and how the goat pops behind the door is their organization system. I keep all their shoes, their home shoes, sorry. And uh, what is it called? Their body lotions and um, their socks, sunglasses, uh, sunscreen, everything is behind there. Let's go into the closet, guys. In the closet here, I have decided to keep everything very, very simple. My kids love to dress up. I think it's something that I have in, in, in place in their brain since they were little they love fashion but i can't buy everything in the market for them so i make sure everything that i have here is what they use now i have divided the closet this side is for the oldest boy that one is for the little, little boy and those are the dress up shirts now here i kept all their dress up pins they were a uh, uh, kind of winter fallish jacket and here i have sweaters and suits and then here is their uh where i kept their shoes now you wonder gladys why do you keep their shoes in here i kept their shoes and their khaki clothes their school uniform and also all of their shoes in there i feel like it makes it easier for them to grab now i went and i added a center scented patch in there so it doesn't smell but yeah i decided to go ahead and organize here and i just love the way it turned out this room took me two days of decluttering and organizing and keeping what they need what they are in need of which brings me peace knowing everything that's there I know what it is. Let's keep touring. I really love this room, guys. It just brings me so much peace and joy to know that the kids are able to keep this room very, uh, what is it called, clean and simple. And kids don't care for, what is it called, beautifulness. They just want a place they can enjoy. And I love this rug, guys. The color of the rug makes this room feel bigger and pop. But it didn't look like that because pr prior, it looked really small. Now, let me show you guys the kids' reaction, guys. You're going to love it. Fermez vos yeux, n'ouvrez pas. Jusqu'à ce que je vous dise d'ouvrir. Marchez un peu, n'ouvrez pas. Marchez. Marchez. Ok. Arrêtez-vous là, arrêtez-vous là. Bétez, ça va. Un, deux, trois.
So if you like how the makeover turned out, please go ahead and click on that like button. Do you like the little home room tour? How I organized all the items? Go ahead and please go ahead and click on that like button. I will truly appreciate it. And uh, share your thoughts. When you communicate, when you engage in the video, YouTube goes ahead and takes interest in it and shares it in the highest of the algorithm. So go ahead and please share your thoughts in the comment below. If you're new here, again, my name is Gladys. I will truly appreciate if you click on that subscribe button. If you love minimizing and decluttering and having a simple lifestyle and you want to be part of this family and this uh, family on the side of the internet here I will truly walk on you over so go ahead and click on that subscribe button God bless you guys see you guys into the next video bye guys